Welcome Aquarius to my channel, Rainbow Wizard. I'll be doing a reading for Aquarius, Sun and Rising and Venus signs. Uh, this is for the middle of October, 2023. It's for Aquarius, Sun and Rising and Venus signs. This is a love reading. Typically, well, I pick up other messages as well. So uh, yeah, I usually pick up messages around you and the person that is showing up in your reading. Um, thank you so much for being here. Welcome to all of you new viewers. You can like, subscribe, share, comment. I've just switched them back on. Now I'm saying this to all, um, um, you know, for, because I'm starting to open the comments. I'm a big advocate of, of mental health and uh, rest assured any comments that is in, inappropriate, appropriate, I can't even speak. <laughs> and it's quite few actually, uh, but uh, I will remove them basically. Uh, and when I mean inappropriate, I do not mean about, um, you know, normal stuff, <laughs> feedback readings, good or bad, right? You know what I mean. So uh, let's move into your reading, Aquarius. We are in the month of Libra. There should be a, a good energy for you, especially if you have... Um, you know, many uh, placements with Aquarius in your chart should flow uh, this month for you, especially as uh, you're moving into the middle of the month of Libra. Ouch. <laughs> so cutting my hand. All right, Aquarius, let's start your reading. I'm using the Rider Waite Tarot deck. It is a giant deck. As you can see, it's difficult to shuffle. Up envy around you, Aquarius. Envy. Well, let's split the cards again. I'm also I can't shuffle today. I'm also picking up new cycles here. I'm seeing that you are standing up for yourself. You could be dealing with the Queen of Wands in reverse. Now, dealing with the Queen of Wands, nevertheless, can also be difficult, but dealing in reverse, uh, you know, this is someone that could be off, off kilter, out of balance, and if they're around you, they could let loose. Now, this could be someone that is envious of what you have. Um, this could be someone that is, you know, around you. Could be a family member, could be colleague, friend, right? To someone around you. I see that there could be a, a person, Aquarius here. There is a person that you've passed the judgment on. You've said, ah, no, nah. I, think, I think I've been dealing with a third party situation, perhaps, and uh, you are ignoring someone. Um, I see someone here, they want to stand up for, um, th they have experience in ending with you. They want to come back from that. They want to fight for this union. They want to fight for this connection or they want to come in and bring justice here. Aquarius, you could feel here when it comes to this uh, person in your feelings, you do not feel good about them um, because you already have passed your judgment. You realize that uh, I want to release this burden that was pulled you apart is that this person didn't really give in to this union emotionally. Now, I see in the past you have started... Um, a journey of creating wealth, Aquarius. So keep on that journey. Now, there could be someone looking for you. This person could have been blindfolded. They have been on a, here it's that, what do I do with this, my, uh, a relationship maybe? Maybe someone here is questioning if they wanna be in a relationship as well. This is a time as well, I'm going to come back to you Aquarius, but it looks like here in your emotions, you here is sure about and there is something to do with hurt when you face it or maybe you have faced it. So let's do see Aquarius. So who is this person? So in their, the actions they want, they, is, this is someone that want a relationship, this is someone that want to move forward, this is someone that... Um, they want to have a big family around them, but then at the same time, they are confused. Mm. 
the hanged man. Mm -hmm. There is ha the hanged man in love here. This person have changed their mind about, or they're in the middle of sort of changing their mind. Also the hangman here, if you see the butterfly, could be someone before they turn into a butterfly, but it's also turning into uh, a something else, right? So it just depends where they want to be. Um, this person here could be, it's that they feel the choice they have made in love has made them trapped. Therefore, love scares this person. So let's say if this person here have had a relationship before you, they have, even though they have feelings for you, they have here said, now nah, love is, go either way, where I go, love will put me in a trap. So it doesn't matter where I am. Um, so, so this person could be very negative, right? This person is someone that's saying, right, okay, I'm going to resolve the challenges here with a partner. If you are in a partnership with them already, that could be you. If you're not, that could be with someone they are with, right? There's also here something about the worst is over. They want to resolve challenges, right? With the magician here, they know that there is a strong a spiritual connection that they have denied. And they could have been wearing a mask ignored the union basically this is a, a prime example of someone that since they're showing up in your reading <clears throat> it's almost like they're annoyed they are in your reading but they are in your reading and there's a reason for it so let's find out why it's this person um because they're not in their emotions here it's as if they are they're going through a struggle where they are and this is someone that complicates things. And if you are associated with them, you could just feel that their energy, <clears throat> like, <coughs> sorry, you are sort of pulled into it. And it is not your energy to take here. This could be, be also someone that is, how they are right now is something they have to finish here. This person is in the middle of a legal matter, perhaps. Uh, if it's someone you just recently have met, right? It could feel a bit sort of, um, it's that not the right time to move forward, for sure, for sure. They have to, if they move forward now in love, there's consequences here. Now, you might know this Aquarius about this person. So it's like, so you have these three cups here and See here, in your current environment, you are setting yourself free with the sun. You have the sun shining in your environment, but in your feelings, to get the sunshine here, there is something about letting go here at Three of Swords. There has been painful uh, emotions here, Aquarius. This could be due to third party. Yeah, very much third party, this is. Now, you, it looks like you have overcome um, this person's... I see that you have overcome this Aquarius. So there's two separate avenues, Aquarius. Something to do about your finances and wealth, that you have a lot of abundance around you, or you have access to abundance when it comes to materialistic wealth. You have that access. You can just keep on shining there. And if things have been st st stalling, it's moving forward. It's moving forward fast ahead. And I think you see it coming. There is something about you. It's something about you. You have this wisdom, Aquarius, that you know you have a birthright to this abundance. It doesn't matter what anyone else say you know it's going to come your way. And that is why you are not rushing when it comes to your abundance. You know that you do not have to worry about it. No, it does not mean that you should take the week off work. It's not about, um, it's something about 
celebration coming to you because of this awareness that you have, that you have all the information required uh, to make decisions in your finances. Even if you might not have done as much as you normally would, where you might see people sweating and doing uh, stressing, where you know, okay, I don't really, I can do something different. There is something that you have uh, under your control. And that's, um, that's your fire <laughs> in October. You're gonna say, ha, I knew it, see, it's happening. And you're going to be uh, having this experience is that, you know what, again, I proved to myself that I've taken the right road. Again, I proved to myself that I know something's going to go my way. So now there is someone here scouting for you. I think this person here is in um, something to do with pain in love or dividing in love, dividing. So their tools, it's, it's here. Um, they want to, they want to be in a spiritual connection. Perhaps they thought they were in a spiritual connection, but in their feelings, they know that it's not really going that way. Arguing is not the answer, right? Avoiding our, our arguments and enemies. This is something about avoiding, knowing that. But here as well, sudden love affair is fast and it's passionate. This could be with you. So it could be someone new even, and this person has this going on. So here it is. It's like a, this could be working through differences, this is someone that is collaborating, want to collaborate with you. This is someone that wants to share this. Um, they want to, to have this equal, equality here. This could be someone that isn't really that emotional in the way they express their love here. So we see that you have experience in your feelings. This could be a Libra or Gemini that you were involved in a third party or there was a third party party thing here that or a heartache here that that happened maybe uh, if the same person is sending you a message you are saying mm, no i'm on a, on a crossroads here i keep my guards up i do not want to actually encounter this person again this is you saying uh you know i rather leave things as they are because that is the safer option here. For your heart, I'm picking up. It's for the safer option, but there is someone that is reaching out. Uh, there has been a choice taken and they're stepping forward towards you. This person could have Virgo in their, uh, Virgo placements in their chart. Can I please get the final outcome for Aquarius? Yeah, see here it is, right. Someone has been playing mind games. You have switched off. You're focusing on your money, your wealth. A person here feels then it's like they created the war. Now they are left at the war uh, sort of site, right? Um, and now they are they're on a crossroads because that was not what they intended. So they could be going through an awakening here. Here it is like, okay, now I can't rush this. I see that you Aquarius here have, um, I do see someone that you will not want to, to reconnect with here. I think that you know someone is sort of scouting, wanting to connect, but you are not giving it too much thought. So we have here um, the most likely outcome. So, all right. Normally this person, um, let's say if you have been out of sight or, or not out of sight, whichever, whichever way it is, Aquarius, 
uh, this person know that if they come back with um, a similar approach, uh, there will be no response here. There will just be an ending at their, it, it will just be an ending. Something here says there is no point waiting. Um, there is no point waiting for something that will continue uh, the same right because you here have you have aquarius what's coming towards you it is that in right time uh, you can walk away from this person because in the in in, in the, at the right time here you will be faced with um you will be faced here with a new beginning and it's not with this person here yeah i see someone someone thought that they could play games uh, with with you and your emotions and that they could continue to do so. And I think that you will show someone that is not going to be the case here. You are taking the high road. You are definitely, definitely uh, not responding to to anyone with these games and you, with this person you've had a choice before Aquarius you've had a choice before but then you could have let them back in and this person somehow takes that liberty to think that they have an opportunity to to play these games in emotions so there's a separation here time apart from your partner and I think this separation you are deciding that when it comes to your emotions you do not have any emotions for this person but there is learning you are waiting for it's safe for you to love so anybody that is showing up on our journey right it's all happening for a reason it's all happening for a reason and uh, i do see here that um, there is a soulmate coming towards you um, I pick up that this is new. Uh, it's something that is happening through a celebration. Uh, you might find out that you have a. It's like, oh, I didn't. I didn't think that I like this person. I didn't think that was my type, right? But then you are sort of like, oh, maybe that is my type. Um, here it could be a Pisces, Pisces and Leo. It's 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 about this person could have a combination of Pisces and Leo. It's something you're realizing and then uh, what you're realizing as well is that you could be uh, moving away from either a Virgo or a Gemini. Or maybe they have both uh, placements in their chart or, or a Libra. Okay, what else for Aquarius? What is the most likely outcome for Aquarius? Yeah, see someone here want to rush in if they get the opportunity to play a few more games, right? They want to go in with their breadcrumbs just because they tell themselves that if they do, if they do so, they have some victory. If you respond to their breadcrumbs, they have victory over you. And this person had been doing this before. And this person could or already be in a relationship and they, ju they just act like that. They, this is someone that... They, they they don't really take that relationship seriously. They're in a relationship and they have also a mask. But you've seen this mask and they have hurt you, but now you are no longer hurt by this person here, the devil. You are no longer hurt by them. This person could be a twin flame, a karmic twin flame. And uh, I see here this person, yeah, very, very deep uh, soulmate ties to this person. Now, this person will try to come back. Um, definitely, in, in the, they are trying to, to come back with a message, but you know it's going to be the same outcome because this person, there's something about that you know, you, you feel where they're at, and so therefore... But I see here, it's like you're going to be very happy. There's something that's going to make you really happy as well at the same time. Um, Whereas this person is someone that constantly wants to win or have one up on someone. 
you're going to show this person that is not what it is about. Maybe they thought that you are playing some games with them, right? Because maybe you didn't put your foot down or something like that. But they are going to see that you do not uh, play any games here. If that was the impression they got, you'll show them that is not um, your situation here. The shadow side. So they could be the shadow side of you, right? Uh, and they might have to... to it's King of Cups. So see here. I see that you are not, uh, you're going to show this person here that you are definitely not playing games with them. So it's a little bit similar to, um, I see Scorpio's reading a bit, right? Where it's like you could, you can give in to someone while they're in a, this sort of agony situation where someone's trying to find a quick fix. Meaning, okay, they are in a difficult situation that is dragging on and that is based on them coming out of confusion and stalling, but then coming over to your side and trying to uh, start a, a romance and, and start something when they're not completing elsewhere, it's not going to work for you. So I see that you here are not going to give in to uh, any messages or any new beginnings with this person because you're showing them that... Uh, if they're going to come towards you, they need to be very, very straight up. We have the year of the tiger, you have the snake, and the year of the goat could be significant here. You're going to be very straight talking, um, Aquarius. I think you're, you have learned throughout your emotions here, when you have felt uncertain with fear and then gone towards love in fear, the, the outcome is still uh, this heartache. So it's kind of leaving you in limbo. You have, you have experienced someone here just giving and scattering a bit of attention to you and they it kept the connection going. Now you are the one being strategic and you're choosing another path. A person here, right, is also, I mean, they can, this can also be you. I mean, in the present time, it's a lot of this cat and mouse going on, right? Someone is going to, if someone is going through like the pain here that this person is going through oh i'll never see aquarius again and now i'm going to be angry with aquarius but i can't really be angry with aquarius because i was the one ghosting them in the first place right so i'm going to go in this hermit mode anyway but they're gaining wisdom here what you are gaining is to know that oh i'm going to release this this situation here was very burdensome this person just scattered me in uh, uh, well information attention whenever they felt like it and i accepted it so i am not much better so here it is that they are going to have to face themselves with their consequences, right? And you are not uh, playing any games with them or giving them any, any uh, um, yeah, indication that you will uh, repeat anything from the past. You will not. Uh, and that's going to be very clear by you... Um, remaining absent when it comes to any communication. This might be what is changing this person's situation, possibly, right? Uh, but it can also here be new love, Aquarius. So we have here the two of wands, the ace of wands, and the ten of pentacles. A lot of abundance coming towards you. It's like you're finding your mojo, you are finding out, you know, what what thrills you here, Aquarius, right? You are going to find out what's your destiny. There is possibly someone from the past here that is resurfacing. This time you are going to remain with the upper hand. You know, it's going to, you're going to, to sail through with the, <laughs> with the upper hand and you always will have the upper hand because you have chosen to, to follow, um, it's as if you are following that new beginning that feels good. You do not uh, return to uh, open an old can of worms, meaning uh, communicate as you used to. This is you not um, responding the way you used to. Everything you're doing could be different. And that is what is putting you on this a path, this new path of yours that is bringing you into this long-term relationship because you are not doing the same as you used to do before. So you're very, very close, Aquarius, to achieve your goals. Expect a powerful change and your dreams need a practical plan. There is a situation where you know nothing will come of it. There is a person here that's, you know, be bold and make the first move and step out of your comfort zone. Aquarius, these were the messages I had for you. Please like, subscribe, share.
the video and uh, I'll see you very soon.